MIUI 12.0.2.0 stable version is here for the Redmi Note 9 as Redmi Note 9 Pro users if you are a Cortana user you can install this build but the thing is this update is only available for the pilot testers if you are a pilot tester you can install this latest update but if you are not a pilot tester but still want to install this build you need a custom recovery for that make sure you have a custom recovery then you can install this update on your device like I have installed it till now this is based on MIUI 12.2.2.0 stable version and doesn't have any kind of change log because of it's a pilot testers update and the thing is just some days ago the MIUI 12.1.7.0 the pilot tester update was released that update and this update doesn't have many much differences only some difference only one major difference basically that is a security patch it's based on Android version 11 which is a very good thing and Android version 10 a recent latest update just released some days ago and that I already reviewed it also you can check out that is a global stable based on android version 10 this one is android version 11 based pilot tester update which is not officially available for all of the users globally in india it's available but not globally it has the latest security patch of 1st of april 2021 which is not that bad not a main security patch by the way but it's not official for all of the users it's just for some testers or you can say pilot testers but everything else is just same here this is redmi note 9s in my hands where we have installed this global stable update Talking about the things which you get here as it's a global stable so yes all the global apps the MIUI apps are not present the global apps are present there and the control center you can see there is no data use style available for you you have the mobile data Wi-Fi Bluetooth and flashlight all these header tiles are available but there is no data user tiles even though the swiping between the notification panel and the control center the option is not available because that option is available in Android version 11 but in MIUI 12.5 this is MIUI 12 it's not MIUI 12.5 this is why that feature is not available just wait for the MIUI 12.5 stable update you might get that feature available here too which is a very good feature by the way talking about the camera related thing Things, photo mode portrait mode etc all the features are present and the thing is there's no difference in camera if you want to unlock some cool interesting features let me just find out some things some cool features if you get here but by default you have only these features even though it doesn't have new MIUI 12.5 camera but if you want to install and if you have a custom recovery then while you are waiting you can install the MIUI 12.5 ports which are available and if you like them you can use them as a daily driver also moving on to some other interesting things which you get here about phone etc you've already saw and it lock screen display etc almost everything has the same kind of features pocket mode launch camera options are available for you and the display settings with the light mode dark mode the new light mode dark mode options available with just a touch need and font text size notifications and control center option is changed from here which is which was present in android version 10 display settings but now in android version 11 this is moved to the main screen but here we have the sound and vibration as it's android version 11 so the thing is we have the sound assistant option available which is not available in android version 10 in android version 11 the feature is present and sound assistant works very good we can simply adjust media sound in multiple apps and multiple audio sources which is a very good kind of feature sometimes i use it on my redmi note 8 but in redmi note 9 pro as this is android version 11 so yeah sound assistant is now available other things are same here as it also comes with the latest sound effects which i don't use it i am not sure but the thing is it's available some users use this so that's a good feature for you app notification option is now available where you can see some options you can customize the notification from some apps if you want or you don't want you can enable or disable notification share etc new control center style which you can simply enable android or easter egg smart home status bar lead customizations and almost everything is same here there are no extra major changes by the way in home screen the best thing is it comes with the new MIUI launcher which comes with this kind of new UI classic and with app drawer where we have some app suggestions background customizations place new apps on the home screen these are the these are not the features which you get in android version 10 by the way in android version 11 you have these features arrange items in recent here's a new arrange items in recent you can simply arrange items in horizontal position the feature is available for you 
other thing else are just kind of same it also includes the normal privacy protection but comes with the new battery app or you can say battery stats which looks actually quite good but everything else is just kind of same these were the things i just wanted to let you know the new update is here if you want to install it as a pilot test you can get this but if you are a custom cover user install from that this is all thanks for watching don't forget to like and share this video goodbye have a nice day over the edge feel like i'm floating through the air